Uh, what men should know about prostate cancer is the PSA is just a simple blood test. A lot of men don't realize that. They think laying on a table with a doctor with a rubber glove. And I get a lot of emails from guys who ask those questions and I res reply back to them and say, no, you know what, it's a, it's a blood test. It's not what you think. Just because you have an eleva elevated PSA doesn't mean you have prostate cancer. So we need to let people know that there's other factors that can come into place when you have an elevated PSA. So if you do have an ele elevated PSA, don't think, oh, you know, I got prostate cancer because that's, that is, that's not the case. That's not the case. There's so many different factors. Like I said, if it's not prostate cancer, it could be testicular cancer. It could be many other things that, you know, as a man, you need to get checked. I mean, when I talk to guys, they never want to talk in a crowd. Hey, it's all right. There's nothing to be afraid about. This is my story. This is what I went through. And it's not the end of the world if you have prostate cancer because it is one of the most curable cancers if caught and detected early. It was an experience just to know that I was 39 and I could die. I was 39 and I could possibly not see my kids again. And now I'm on the other side trying to make people aware, make men aware of the importance of getting tested, the importance of knowing your number, the importance of knowing your family history, the importance of, of of speaking up and knowing if you feel anything that it's okay. It doesn't mean that you're weak if you have to go to the doctor. And I think a lot of guys don't realize by knowing your number is a simple blood test. They think if I get my PSA checked, then it's the whole invasive, the finger that everybody dreads. And that's not the case. That's one of the, the things I'm trying to help raise awareness for. In this field, a single decision can change a game. For a man with prostate cancer, a single decision can change his entire life. While I chose surgery, a less aggressive approach called active surveillance might be the best choice for you. Ask your doctor about a genomic test that may help you make the right decision. Learn more at yourprostateyourdecision.com.